Wisconsin. President Biden visited the college town of Madison, Wisconsin, to roll out a new plan for canceling thousands of dollars of student debt for millions of Americans. The ability for working and middle class folks to repay their student loans has become so burdensome that a lot can't repay it for even decades after being in school. This plan focuses on high interest rates, providing relief for borrowers who now owe more than their original loan was worth. The loan forgiveness would apply to people who have been paying undergrad loans for 20 years or more, or grad student loans over the last 25 years. It also applies to those already eligible for loan forgiveness and for borrowers who can prove financial hardships prevent them from repaying their loans. I will never stop to deliver student debt relief on hardworking Americans, and it's only in the interest of America that we do it. And again, it's for the good of our economy. It's no coincidence the plan was unveiled in Wisconsin, one of the big swing states this election cycle. Student debt relief is a popular proposal among progressive voters. But some legal challenges are expected. The Supreme Court struck down a previous attempt by the Biden administration to forgive hundreds of millions in student loans. The Supreme Court was very clear in saying that Biden's loan forgiveness policy was an overreach of his executive power and overreach of his authority. This smaller, more targeted plan will still require a months long public comment period before it can take effect, narrowing the chances it will be implemented before Election Day. Nicole Skanga, CBS News, the White House.